Sri Lanka is done with corruption. Sri Lanka expects to present an anti-corruption bill to the parliament in the coming days. The cabinet spokesperson said as Sri Lanka has been urged by the IMF to reduce corruption after getting a loan of 3 billion dollars. This needs to be done through improving public financial management and fiscal transparency, introducing a stronger anti-corruption legal framework, and conducting an in-depth governance diagnostic. And President Ranil Wickremesinghe aims to establish the best anti-corruption law in South Asia. This law is being drafted by Justice Minister Vijay Das Rajapaksa, which will be presented in Parliament so all the ministers can analyze if they want to be against corruption just yet. The IMF policy focuses on state functions that are most relevant to economic activity. fiscal governance financial sector oversight central bank governance and operations market regulation rule of law anti money laundering and combating the financing of terrorism most sri lankans are furious about systemic corruption with political leaders ignorant of curbing them they have blamed failures to curb corruption to today's looming economic crisis which later turned into a political crisis and apparent 